Hi, I'm Rosie Perez, and this is Variety's Power Women. Feminism means to me pure and simple equality. What makes me feel powerful as a woman is coming to grasp with my own self-worth and not apologizing for it, not compromising it, and letting that knowledge just shine through. My thoughts on Latino representation in Hollywood is that it sucks. Has it gotten better? Yes, it has. It is improving year by year, decade by decade, but we still have an immensely long way to go. We are the most underrepresented group outside of Native Americans in the Hollywood system. Yet, we make up the biggest consumer in the Hollywood system. It doesn't make sense. The math doesn't add up and things still need to change, so I am not happy. I've been in this business for 30 plus years, and I've been asked the same question in almost every interview I've ever had, and I keep repeating the same answer over and over and over again. It's like, wake up, people. Wake up. The worst audition ever was for a movie I didn't get. <laughs> That was The Matrix. <laughs> it was horrible. As I was walking out, I was like, I know I didn't get the job, I really sucked. And they were like, no. And the casting director was trying not to laugh. And then finally I looked at her and go, I really sucked. And she just burst out laughing. It was for the Carrie and Moss role. I was terrible. I was totally off my game. That's one thing about that I know about myself. That is part of my power. I know when I'm good and I know when I'm not. And I have the confidence to acknowledge both. The two most challenging roles that I've had are, one was when I did Frankie and Johnny and the Claire de Lune on Broadway, and it was only a two-hander, meaning there was only two people on stage for two hours. And I remember after opening night, Larry Fishburne came back and he looked at me and he went, I said, what is that? And he said, you went to the next level, good job. And I burst into tears. And the other was Fearless, the movie with Jeff Bridges. That movie was so difficult for me to go to a dark place that I understood. That also allowed me to grow as an actress as well, and as a person, quite frankly. I am offering you a chance to help bring down the single greatest threat to New Orleans, to atone for what you have done. The most fun moment on your honor would probably be my first day. I was a nervous wreck and Brian Cranston was so supportive. When I walked on set, everybody was very, very quiet because they knew I only had two days, two days from the day I got the offer to the day I was on set. Once I got a solid takedown, Brian screamed out, you did it! And everyone, the entire crew just started applauding. And I just said, oh my gosh, I was so nervous. I don't know if you guys could tell. And Brian goes, oh, we all could tell. 